started with requests made on his channel, yes it did. To do a show that's nostalgic for the 2000s kid. Now he's got new subscribers and for Tuesday's getting big. It's Drew's View. Drew's View. Now if you tune in, you might be in for a big surprise. He doesn't get excited and his humor is real dry. But he pays close attention and he tries to analyze. Drew's View. Stop as the pen fans say That he's the baddest reactor to ever make their day Drew's view To the true Drew's view To the true To the true To the true Hey, we got Drew's views here and I'm back for a little Car Tuesday, reacting to them cartoons on Tuesday, doing it Ben 10 style. And today I'm on season four, episode seven, according to Hulu. I also looked on Wikipedia where it said it was episode eight. So I'm going to call it seven on this. I don't know, I've been watching it on Hulu. Uh, I didn't check on HBO Max to see what they were calling it, but... Anyway, it's the whole issue of the movie being in the middle of the season and counting his episodes. Decisions have been made, though, to watch the movie at the end of the season here. So the secrets of the Omnitrix will not yet be revealed to me. But let's see what we may have this time. This episode is going to be called Ben for Good Buddies. So that's like a, a pun on what they would say, like truckers would say back in the day on their CB radios, I think. And who knows, it could be a double meaning too, I guess, with four. We're going to see four different aliens. Will we see any new aliens? I don't know. We didn't see any last time. Last time we had some nuptials between uh, one of Grandpa's relatives, his nephew, I guess. I was saying it was a little bit of a strange episode, and some people are commenting too that it wasn't their favorite, I guess, or somebody, someone even called it filler, I think. Which I don't necessarily go that far, but I was questioning, like, oh, so Grant, like, it's just a family affair completely with these. I mean, I think it was their grandpa's actual relatives, not just like, a, you know, my friend's son is my nephew sort of thing, I think. But yeah, so it was all plumbers of versus, uh, Sludges, sludge aliens, uh, it was a Romeo Juliet situation. The Capulets tried to turn into, uh, yeah, turn into different uh, people, body snatched them to stop the wedding, but the Montagues uh, took out their plumber <laughs> guns and, and stopped it. And then mostly Ben, of course, saving the day with a little heat blast, etc. So it went down. But yeah, so this time, I guess, I mean, look, it's a road trip obviously the all series so it makes sense to have some kind of trucker thing going on or something so i'm gonna guess it's gonna have something to do with that but of course the only way to find out is to get into the episode let's do it Alright, I really like that one. That type of episode's definitely up my alley with the vibe. It's, I mean, it's a little like Mad Max or uh, any number of road kind of chase movies where you got the kind of crazy guys, carves us guys, and either like pirates here, I guess is what they're calling them, but uh, chasing down your heroes or people just trying to pass through. In this case, they're chasing down the nice RV initially, of course, but... Uh, grandpa intervened as he would do um so yeah a lot of cool stuff in this one i like the characters the pirate kind of the characters too they're pretty amusing they weren't too um they didn't go too over the top with their kind of i mean they had the voices and stuff but they didn't go too over the top with dumb jokes or anything and i liked all their their all their car setups were cool like the the gt looking thing or whatever this the you know, muscle car, then the kind of tow truck one and all that, uh, and the monster truck, 
And yeah, a lot of cool like shots on the highway, action shots. That was really cool. And she went through the billboard and uh, just popped. I got stuck in there and just popped out and jumped on the moving truck. I like that they didn't fight. Like there was no arguments really between Ben and Gwen this time or anything like that or with Grandpa or anything. That was good. We saw Up Chuck again. Interesting uh, tidbit there that he can't eat real food. You know, human food. Almost like a vampire or something. But instead of blood, it's a... Uh, just any inanimate objects or whatever. Oh, I guess food's inanimate, but you know what I mean. Of course, I've got we're driving past here all the time, racing past here as well, causing noise on my videos. So I'm, I'm used to it anyway, I guess. With the vibe of this one fits in. So yeah, it was a really fun one. You know, we didn't get any um, reoccurring villains or anything back. Um, but yeah, like we like said a little more about Upchuck, one of the newer ones. More good upgrade action, the train and all that. And uh, yeah, it was just cool. Uh, and some like funny kind of uh, the new RV jokes with the, this from, like I was saying, I guess probably from 2008 or whenever this came out with they're talking about all the Wi Fi, all the, the video game systems, all of that. But uh, yeah, so Ben 4, good buddy. That will have, <laughs> if that was episode 7. Uh, I'll be back next time for episode 8 or whichever one it's going to be. You'll find out by the name. But do comment. Tell me uh, if you like this one as well. Of course, subscribe if you're not already. Like everything like that. But until then, stay safe on the road out there. And I'm out. Peace, good buddies.